and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Pula at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. Today, we got the brand new NFL 100 players. Now, guys, last night they dropped the LT, Allen Page, Deacon Jones, and Bobby Bell. Quadruple right there, whatever you call that. Quadruplets. They dropped all four of them last night after the NFL 100 picks, but I was not home again. My schedule did not match up for this again, so I sadly missed out on that one. But if you guys haven't already seen, I did post this morning about 8 a.m., so if you guys haven't, go check that video out after this one. But it was supposed to be a drop of seven, so they did split it up into two, so it was four last night. And inevitably three this morning. So I'm gonna be going over the new ones. Uh, it's supposed to be Mean Joe Green, I believe Reggie, and I'm blanking on the other one. But you guys get the point. It's gonna be pretty cool to get these out. First time I'm actually gonna be home for one of the NFL 100 drops. So hopefully the stats are pretty good. Hopefully everything's pretty good. I gotta get my coins up so that I can actually get some of these cards. Some of these cards look pretty insane. Although I don't know who I'm gonna replace. If I do get some of these cards, I have some pretty good cards that are powered up in place already on my team. But we got to see how that all goes. So before we get into the video, if you guys are new to the channel, go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that on, boys, come join the family. Each and every one of you that keeps joining every day, I appreciate you guys. Let's see if we get to 14k within the next like four or five days. So make sure to spam that, uh, that sub button. Let me know what you guys think down below these cards as we go through all their stats. Let me know what you guys think in, in general, because I'm kind of curious to see what you guys think of these cards. So far from the first batch, I like Lawrence Taylor the most. I kind of like Bobby Bell, but I have to see what else I end up doing. Once I get some coins, obviously. And also, make sure to hit that like button. Can we get 300 plus likes on the 1030 content video? As of now, if you're watching, spam that like button. Let's see if we can get to it. Everyone, don't forget to like. Now, let's get into the players and the stats. And guys, make sure you're getting your solos done. Real quick to show you guys, the NFL 100 solo challenges are out. Specifically, the uh, ones from last night. The newer ones are not out yet. It's, it's in two releases. So, Lawrence Taylor, Bobby Bell, and Alan Page. Make sure you're getting these done. They're really quick. They take literally, you can do all five, four of them in like six minutes. This one's get a sack. Don't allow first down this drive. Get a sack. And then get two user tackles and three drives. This one's probably the hardest one or the longest one right here. Not going to be a horrible game. You also get all their power ups. You can either sell them or power them up. Make sure you're getting them done because if you do complete every single week, which I'm pretty sure they lock after a certain date, if you do complete every week, you are able to obtain a actual full version NFL 100 player from any of the drops. Now, I don't know if it'll be fantasy or if it'll be random, guys, but make sure you're playing it because you definitely do not want to miss out on that. Like, I already missed it on my 10. This is kind of like the second version of my 10 that you guys probably want to be getting done. But that's pretty much it. Let's get it over to all the cards and check them all out. All right, guys, so the first card that we have here is Reggie White. I'm doing a screenshot on this one because the cards are not up yet. And I kind of have a schedule to go, you know, be at. So at the moment, Reggie White, 92 overall. Well, nine, number 92. Left end, Reggie White on the Eagles. Now, this card did just come out. It's him, Reggie White, Mean Joe Green, and... Why do I keep messing up the other one? Reggie White, Mean Joe Green, and... I'm not going to get it right. Anyway, so he's got 95 strength, 73 agility, 80 speed, 88 excel, 93 awareness, 92 tackles, 73 jumping, 91 impact blocking, 95 power move, and 90 finesse move. So the important stats here are going to be that power move and that, uh, that athleticism. Now, as a whole, this card's pretty insane. I can imagine he's above 90 blocks here too. His speed being an 80 and 88 is going to mean that he's going to be one of the most athletic ends in the game. He's going to be right there with Bosa just about. Uh, Bosa might be slightly more athletic. But he's going to be right there about with the athleticism. Plus that 95 power move. Kemmed up and everything. He's going to get close to like a 98 power move. And if you actually put him on like a John Madden team. With John Madden pass rush. You're probably going to get this guy to like a 99 power, uh, power move. Which is going to mean that with his athleticism and his power move. Plus his blocks. He's probably the best offensive uh, lineman in the whole game. So that's pretty crazy as it is. I find it quite ridiculous that these cards are out as early as they are in the game. They're going to be pretty amazing. Pretty glitchy. It's scary, guys. This game's going to be ruined by December with how many good cards we're going to have. It's going to be like a whole NFL arcade game at this point. But this Reggie White does look really, really good. Now, let's head on over to the Bob uh, Willie Lanier. Okay, so, Willie Lanier is now on the block. Willie Lanier, 94 overall middle linebacker. He goes for 1.17 million coins right now. Wow. He's got that archetype, like, commander-looking thing. He's 6'1", so pretty, pretty decent height. 87 speed. 87 agility. I mean, 87 acceleration. 86 strength. So, so far, solid athleticism. 91 tackles, amazing. 93 play wrecks, amazing. 94 block shed. Wow, he's going to be probably one of the best run stuffing linebackers in the game. 94 hit power. That's amazing. And 90 zone. Let's see what his underlying stats are. 86 strength. 93 awareness. Let's see what else he's got. 82 jumping. That's decent considering if you're going to use him, you probably want that a little bit higher. 86 impact blocking. 91 pursuit. 80 zone. We saw that already. And let's see. Hit power is 94. We saw that. 
and that should conclude lead block 83 i don't really think he needs to lead block for anything let's compare him to ray lewis real quick and see how he stacks up so ray lewis is better speed better excel better strength i don't care that he's powered up guys because they're both gonna be because i mean they're both 94 overall so it's kind of even 88 strength 93 tackle even play rec block shed by four hit power by one zone by 11 so honestly if you use a ray lewis the zone's not going to matter, but if you're not going to use a Ray Lewis, Willie Lanier is pretty much Ray Lewis that you don't have to use or you can play zone on his own. So it is pretty useful. I mean, I have I don't think it's worth upgrading, you know, 100, 800,000 coins to a million coins to get him right now. I mean, if I happen to pull him out of my Centennial pack, probably just sell him. I think I'd much rather just be with Ray Lewis for now, although Willie Lanier is definitely a decent amount better, especially when you power him up and chem him up and every, everything. But for the difference as of now from my team, I think I'm pretty good with Ray Lewis considering it's just the zone. And I typically use a Ray Lewis because I like to have Shazier in his own zone because he has the 86. So the zone not really be impacted. And the hit power is close enough, the blocks is close enough, and the athleticism is pretty much the same. So not much of a difference outside of the zone. So these cards are pretty, pretty similar. Not going to lie. I wonder what else. Oh, so Reggie White's up. So let me show you guys the full Reggie White stats now. Reggie White stats now. So now he's got 79 speed, 87 excel. That was the powered up one I was showing you. 94 strike, 91 tackle, 92 play rec, 94 block shed, 94 power move, and 89 finesse move. So... The block shed's amazing. So powered up and chemmed up and everything. He's gonna have like a close to like a high 99, close to 99 block shed, close to 99 power move, above 90 finesse move, above 90 play rec, above 90 tackle, above 90 strength, above 90 excel more than likely, and above 80 speed. This car is going to be one of the best, if not the best, pass rusher in Madden. Compared to my Joey Bosa, it's not even a debate. He completely destroys him considering the move he has, plus his athleticism right there, right in line with it, plus the strength, plus the tackle, plus the block shed. Best left end of the game, best pass rusher in the game. And now we have Mean Joe Green, the final card. Six foot four, 77 speed, 82 excel. So that's pretty solid. 93 strength, amazing. 90 tackle, great. Play rec, 88, great. 94 block shed, 91 power move, 77 finesse move. Now we compare him to my defensive tackle, which should be an easy blow away. Michael Pierce, way more athletic. Similar strength, way better tackle, similar play rec, way better block shed, way better power move, way better finesse move. So now the, the thing with Mean Joe Green, he's probably gonna be the best run stuffing defensive tackle in the game, at least close to it up there with it while also being one of the best pass rushers in the game with a 91 power move 82 excel 77 speed out of the defensive tackle spot this means you is going to be insane let's see what his impact blocking is let's see let's see what his other underlying stats are impact block is a 93 so he's gonna be able to take on blocks pretty well 89 pursuit so he can chase down the quarterback at any running backs i mean as much as you can with a 77 speed right uh let's see what else he's got hit power 90 wow so Joe green is gonna be good he looks kind of like a really slow linebacker this card looks really amazing, quite honestly. Six foot four frame, although I wish that, I mean, the height doesn't mean too much out of the defensive tackle spot, because it's not like last year you can get those uh, QB spy picks anymore like you used to be able to get. But still a pretty insane card. Now, if I had to rank him, like, who I would I want here? I think first, I'd probably want Reggie White, and then I want Mean Joe Green, then Willie Lanier. I mean, for my team person, like, in order from who's best to, who's best to worst, probably put Reggie White first, Willie Lanier second, and then Mean Joe Green. But for my personal team, I think I'd take White first. That means you're green than linear. They are coming down in price already, as you guys can see. So don't expect them to be that expensive for much longer. But that is about it for this video. Let's head over to the outro and finish up all of that so we can get out of here and we can go finish up this video. All right, guys, so that is about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to go down below. Comment also what you guys thought of the cards because I'm kind of curious to see what you guys think. Now, me personally, I really like the Mean Joe Green and the Reggie Wayne. Reggie White. I knew I was going to call him Reggie White. The whole video, I was thinking that I'm going to call him Reggie Wayne. Now, Lanier is cool and all, but I already have Ray Lewis and Chase Ears. So I don't really want to invest too much money into linebacker, quite personally. Now, Mean Joe Green's a solid offensive tackle. I really do kind of want that Mean Joe Green, but he's going to cost a lot. My personal recommendation, guys, if you want a Centennial player or you want one of the um, Redux cards, you have to wait till later. Later today, they're going to be dropping the Centennial pack. Show you guys what I'm talking about. Here's a quick little tip I got. I will make a whole video going over a lot of this stuff. But later tonight, they do drop a Blitz offer Centennial pack, which we believe might be one free NFL 100 player. So you guys wait till 12 midnight tonight. The market should crash on Centennial players. So do not buy them yet. I'd recommend you wait because you are going to be able to get these for pretty cheap, in my opinion, afterwards. So I'm going to wait to try to get some coins up real quick. And the series Redux on December 2nd also. So I wouldn't buy Reduxes or Centennial players. You said I'd wait until these packs drop because the prices should dramatically increase, especially to de um, decrease considering they made these non-limiteds. They made them an hour long. A lot of people are going to get them cost 20 bucks so it's not like it's the cheapest thing but a lot of people will be doing it so i'd recommend you wait or just do it i'll probably end up doing it because i definitely want some of these players hopefully it's it is a fantasy pack it says so maybe we could pick from a few guys 
I'm looking for Lawrence Taylor, Mean Joe Green, or maybe Reggie White. I still got to decide on what, what, like, what route I'm going to take on that one. But I am kind of excited for that. So make sure you wait for that because the market should crash pretty significantly after that. And guys, if you're already to the channel, go down below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn that on to well, boys. Come join the family. Comment down below what you think of these three cards. And make sure to spam that like button. Let's see if we can get 300 likes in this 1030 content video. Make sure to spam that like button, boys. And come join the family. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. Expect like seven more videos today. I'm out. See you guys next week. Peace.